Mr. Biscuits, our floofy little three-legged cat loves being part of our happy hour ritual. Cheers. He is addicted to his kitty cat cocktails. <laughs> Literally the minute that he hears ice hit the shaker, he is running into the kitchen waiting for his drink to be poured. How many seconds until my cat realizes he's getting a cocktail? One. Oh. Hi, Mr. Biscuits. We noticed he just doesn't drink enough water. Do you want a cocktail? We were just trying to find a creative way to get him more liquids, too. And what better way than a kitty cat cocktail? Yum. He is expecting them at this point. I don't know if we've created a monster. He knows that when the sun starts to set, he's going to get a cocktail soon. What are you doing? Our coworker, Liz, one day she was sitting out in her backyard and saw this little three-legged kitty. She immediately trying to see if anyone could help foster. John's a crazy cat lady. He's wanted a cat for a long time. We fostered him for about a few hours and then we're like, we're adopting him. He was hooked from the start. Biscuits, I have a new cocktail glass for you. We thrift little glasses for him all the time because it's just hilarious. Do you love it? Hi, guess it's Evan from the Dodo. Nice to see you. So I saw your kitty cocktails for Mr. Biscuits. I'm actually cat sitting right now for a friend. Amazing. Cats are super shy around me. I wanted to do something nice for them. Do you think I could get your recipe? Yeah, of course you can. And you're going to win those cats over real quick. I will let you know how this goes. Please do. I'm on the edge of my seat. Mr. Biscuits always has to have a really nice glass. So I'm going to try to find one for Luna and Zara. Zara. No, I'm not gonna do it. Catnip. Perfect. How'd it go? <laughs> it went amazing. They both loved it. That's really sweet. It's a sweet little way to deliver their treats and just another way to connect with your animals. Hello. Cocktail? Cocktail. Yeah, more cocktail? Cocktail? <laughs>